Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Now I'm going to be discussing and reviewing something I have already reviewed but um, tonight it is My Perfect Eyes, Is It Worth Buying? Does It Work? And the answer is yes it works. Is it worth buying? Now that's entirely up to you obviously. It depends on how you can apply it. Now the upside to My Perfect Eyes is it works when you apply it <clears throat> it actually does take temporarily take away any l lines and wrinkles and um, a creepiness from under your eyes now that does work the downside to my perfect eyes unfortunately is um, you can't wear any eye creams you can't wear any um, makeup with um, oils or water uh, it all has to be mineral powder. Now, I did discuss that on another video, but um, that is the downside to it. Now, there is another downside to it, sadly. Uh, on application, if you're not a real pro, you do get a bit of frosting, as they call it, and uh, that leaves just like a white, I'll, I'll show you in a minute, a white sort of a residue around um, the eye area. If and you think, oh, I've rubbed that in well. And then you look and you think, what is that? It's all that white stuff. And it's it's the frosting that this gives you. Now, how my perfect eyes works is when you apply it, it creates a, a webbing, a webbing underneath the eye area. And that webbing begins to tighten up and it does um, diminish your wrinkles, fine lines, creepiness. It does do that. It really does. But... Um, like I said, downsides, no makeup, no eye creams. The other downside to this is after you've, you know, you've put on your application, um, you're looking, you think, oh my God, that looks amazing. Oh, jeez, that's great. And within a very short time, your uh, under eye area feels very, very dry. And a little short time after that, is that a word, a little short time? A short time after that, it actually starts to look a bit false it doesn't look natural and um i suppose if you had your mineral powders and you were trying to cover it up with mineral powders etc you know you may cover it enough that it looks natural but uh, it doesn't really look that natural and it they say it lasts from eight to ten hours i haven't had it on that long to last to, to review eight to ten hours but then i thought well i might as well if i'm going to be making this video it doesn't last eight to ten hours. You have to keep reapplying it, and I kept the camera. Oh, sorry. Um, you have to keep reapplying it, and it's drying, drying, drying up your eyes. Now, this stuff would be absolutely brilliant if they could make something <clears throat> that you could apply moisturizers, apply face creams, apply your um, anything that you put under your eyes. I, like I got a few um, um, comments before. Oh, it looks great, but I cannot live without my sealer. Yes, Carla, that was you. And um, there was a few, I keep kicking this camera. It's the way I'm sitting. I've got my legs crossed and I keep waving my feet about kicking cameras. Sorry. But, um, so that is the downside. Now, you do have to give it an almighty shake. And I'm talking about beating this thing up now i've already been shaking it ages just before i made this video so maybe yeah, a little shake will do so i'm just going to show you if you were just an average joe and you put it on the back of your hand you give it a wee rub and you're thinking right i'll wipe told me wipe and swipe so i'm wiping i'm swiping and dabbing less is more so i only put on too much right that's it. Job done. Or if you're doing it on the other eye and you're taking a bit more care, just putting this on the back of my hand because it's easier for the application rather than from that little stick thing. And you're wiping and you're dabbing. And you know that you might get the white residue underneath so you're trying to spread it out as much as you can so that you don't get that and trying to dab it and really get it underneath all those areas so that no residue comes. So I'm, 
So I gave it this more attention than the other one. So hopefully I'll get no frosting is the same. Now, it, is, um, it, it does take 60 seconds as, well, I'm sure if you've... If you've been sort of looking at reviews to this, it's, you always get a professional doing it. Um, some people do review it and they do like it, but they're not happy like an hour into it because they think their eyes actually look worse than they did prior. Now, I'm not criticising this product. This product is great. Now, I was using it before, did find it very good, but I only had it on for a short time because to be honest with you, I couldn't stand that really dry, dry under eye feeling that I got. It was like, it was like I was frightened to smile in case my, my, my eyes started to crack. It's very, very tightening. I think this product would be absolutely amazing if you were going, uh, maybe at Christmas time you were getting some pictures taken or you were getting family portraits done and you wanted to look your best and uh, you know things like that or you're one of these um, people that have a few under eye problems but you're pretty cool on the old Instagram and Facebook and you want to look your best pop it on brilliant for that it's um, it's good for that now I'm going to just zoom you in if I can I don't know what I do with this camera oh it's pretty good oh there we go now, it's taken away my under eye lines. Now, will it frost unless I've just got so bloody good at it? It's not going to frost for the purposes of this video. No, I'm not doing anything that would um, undermine my perfect eyes. It does work, but you do get that tight, tight and very dry feeling. Now, like I said, you can't wear your favourite makeups, your favourite um, concealers, and that's just the downside to it, which is a shame. But, you know, if they could make a product like this that you can pop on anything that you want, any of your eye serums, your eye creams, your concealers, your um, favourite foundations, wouldn't it be fabulous? Nobody would have to go for, for surgery. Or, all you'd have to do is buy this stuff and you could use you could use it every day. You'd be buying it like once a month. It would be great. It'd be great for the company as well. Now, am I getting any frosting? I don't know. I'm just... I don't, this thing is doing my, my head in. I can't believe it. This is the first time I've used it that I haven't got loads of frosting. But... I better stop moving a bit. No. Maybe it's because I spent so long shaking it. Jeez, do you know something? Maybe I have to eat my own words. It is great for diminishing um, fine lines and wrinkles, but like I said, it does have its downsides. All the makeup that you absolutely love and you want to wear, all your concealers that you love and you want to wear, all your under eye creams that you love and want to wear, you can't use them with this. It will do a great job. And um, the only thing is, if you're using moisturiser anywhere but here, well, here, it's like a lot of um, moisturisers and um, oils, they travel. So it may actually break down the barrier that, you know, that little webbing I was telling you about, may break it down quicker than you had anticipated because they do travel. That's why if you're wearing any... Um, um, sort of a serums they tell you don't put it on your eyelids put it just here or here because they do travel you know that's the thing but anyway guys this is my perfect eyes does it work yes indeed it certainly does but you cannot wear all that glamorous makeup that you've bought to make yourself look the best and you think, oh, well, I'll buy my perfect eyes and all my glamorous makeup and I'll look fantastic. Unfortunately, you can't use it, girls. Sorry about that. But um, it does work. Buy a mineral powder if you really want it and use a mineral powder underneath the eye area and you will look absolutely fabulous. Under eye area will feel really, really dry and tight, but you'll look fabulous. So anyway, guys, that's the My Perfect Eyes little review and demonstration. To all my new subscribers, 
you're very, very welcome into the family. And to anyone who would love to subscribe and hit that not notification bell so that you can catch all my other uploads, if I can actually see it properly. Anyway, guys, good night. God bless. Love you. Bye.